All right, Jen St. Dennis joins us from business in Vancouver. We'll update those numbers. I, I think they're a little bit old, but regardless, uh, Jen, the Canadian dollar is very low. It uh, hit a, a more than 10 year low yesterday. Yeah, that's right. Uh, we haven't seen the Canadian dollar this low since 2004, and we saw that uh, hit 76 cents uh, U.S. yesterday. Uh, now, today it's up a little bit. Uh, the numbers I saw were around 77 cents. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, what's happening with the Canadian dollar is that it is not forecast to really uh, rise a lot. It's going to stay low, and there are several reasons for that. So let's talk about them. Uh, so one big reason, of course, is the falling price of oil, and we've seen this batter the Canadian economy uh, in a really big way. Um, and that is one of the factors behind the decline yesterday. The price of oil fell further. Um, also, commodities in general, uh, things like uh, copper, gold, coal, have been really battered over the past few years and have been low. And that has also uh, been a factor. And the price of gold also fell yesterday. Now, another factor is just the general state of the Canadian economy. Of course, we saw the Bank of Canada uh, cut its key lending rate uh, this July in response to uh, six months of declining economic growth, meaning that we're technically in a recession. To, so to avoid you know, that full-blown recession, the bank is trying to stimulate the economy. Now, meanwhile, looking south of the border, the American economy is going in the other direction. They're seeing uh, more of a recovery. They're seeing the, their economy picking up steam to the point that the Federal Reserve uh, is really, really is expected to raise their interest rates, with, which they have been keeping very low for a long time. They're expected to raise their interest rates possibly as early as September. And when that happens, that's expected to exert more downward pressure on the dollar uh, because of the difference in the, way, the ways the economies are going. Uh, and just more volatility is expected uh, for the Canadian dollar in the future. Sophie?